Black and White Network fans, we are back with another video, and I want to start off this video by saying congratulations to you never Trumpers. Congratulations to you Biden voters. This man has destroyed this country. This man is an unmitigated disaster. A complete disaster. Everything that he touches turns to shit. It does. I know that Trump said everything woke turns to shit. Well, everything Biden turns to shit. And now, guys, you guys are paying for it. I'm paying for it. You're paying for it as well, folks. Under Donald Trump, the U United States was actually um, energy independent, probably the first time in my lifetime. And then all of a sudden, Mr. Biden gets into the Oval Office at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. And then he just stat Thanos snaps oil and gas. Americans lose their job. Because this man wants to pander to his Democratic Party and kill the Keystone Pipeline. And in turn, he actually has you, the American people, buying Russian oil. Russian oil. And now congratulations, guys, because check this out. Gas prices top $4 per gallon for the first time since 2008. And then it gets worse, folks. Gallon of gas up almost 50 cent since Russia invaded Ukraine. And I noticed this, folks, because I actually posted on Getter. And uh, I got gas the other day and I said, man, this was the highest price gas that I paid for in well over 10 years. And I was actually thinking on 2008 because I remember at that time. I was driving a uh, Nissan Altima and that gas was. Almost at four dollars a gallon. And I was a waiter. It took a lot of money to fill up that tank. And I wasn't making the kind of money that I make now. But this is what you voters wanted. This is what you're getting now. You're feeling the price not only at um, the grocery store, but also at the pump. And I noticed a whole bunch of other things, man, that's actually went up in price, too. And I'm pretty sure you guys have, too, as well. But uh, check this out. The U.S. national average for a gallon of regular unleaded gasoline crossed the four dollar mark for the first time since 2008 on Sunday, up almost 50 cent since Russia invaded Ukraine less than two weeks ago. Oh, yes, man. Joe Biden wants you to buy oil from people that hate you. But Joe Biden was perfectly comfortable, actually. You know, killing American jobs. This man despises America. The national average, which hit uh, four dollars and um, it says point zero zero nine cent. On Sunday, according to AAA, is about 10 cents from the all time record high of four dollars and 11 cent seen in July 2008. I remember that boy. That was brutal back then. The nationwide average is up nine cents since Saturday and 47 cents since Russia invaded Ukraine 11 days ago, which has put a strain on the global market. U.S. lawmakers on both sides of the political aisle have been ramping up pressure on the Biden administration to ban all Russian oil and gas imports. But the administration has said it wouldn't be possible without uh, creating an even bigger, bigger height in gas prices at home. Well, Joe Biden, what you should have done is, is stop depending on foreign oil from the beginning. All you had to do was leave in place what Trump had put in place. But oh, no, all of you never Trumpers, all of you people that vote socialists. This is what you get. And we're all paying the price for it now. But I hope you I hope you guys are happy with your president. I do hope you guys are very, very happy with this. Everybody has realized that this man is an unmitigated disaster. And I'm pretty sure secretly, probably even people that voted for Joe Biden are wishing that Trump is around. I'm pretty sure that uh, you guys really wish that Trump was around. You may be criticizing him, you know, for mean tweets and things like that. But now you can't even fill up your tank. You can't even fill up your tank. I hope you you Biden voters are very, very 
happy. During his State of the Union address Tuesday, Biden announced the U.S. is releasing 30 million barrels from its strategic petroleum reserve to protect consumers from the rising prices. But the average continued to climb because, like I said, everything Biden turns to shit. And it's going to get worse. We still have another, what, three years of this, man? My goodness. My goodness. I hope you guys are happy. I hope you guys, you never Trumpers and Biden voters are happy with this. And it's going to it's going to continue to climb. I've heard reports of um, seven dollar gas. And that probably just means California, which means out here where I'm at in the Houston area is probably like five dollars. But I hope you guys are happy with Biden. You people that voted for this, man, I hope you guys are extremely happy with this disaster. When single mothers can't put food on the table or put gas in that car to go to work, I hope you guys are happy. I hope you guys are very happy with this. And some of you people that can't put food on the table, can't fill up your cars. Or that you may have to do without, you know, providing a birthday presents for your kids. I hope you're happy with Biden. I hope you guys are very, very happy with Mr. Biden. Four dollar gas. The highest. Since 2008. This really just does frustrate, frustrate me, folks, because when I got gas the other day, uh, right down the road from my house is a uh, shell station. Three dollars and 70 cent. Now. Down uh, another gas station down the road from me this morning, 380. This thing is increasing and increasing fast. And I'm stuck in this rental car right now, which is not very fuel efficient at all for me. Can't wait to get my Toyota Prius back. I really can't wait to get it back because that car is definitely great on gas. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white network fans. All you never Trumpers, you're getting what you want. He's not in office, but now your life is a hell of a lot worse. And I do mean a hell of a lot worse because of Joe Biden. Anyway, guys, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and we'll catch you next time.